when you begin to think about the process of disciple making, it's important to have a vision in mind, an end vision that you know what is your heart, what is your desire as you begin to engage in the process of disciple making. For me, I have such a heart for the people in the area where I live, and I'm, I really want to see a movement begin where not just a few, but ultimately, not just me, but everybody that's engaged, we will see thousands of people come to faith in Christ. So much so that you begin to see um, uh, communities transformed and marriages strengthened and divorce rates go down. And you have a heart for seeing so many people come to faith in Christ that abuse is ended and addictions are eliminated and crime is reduced, that you see an incredible impact of the gospel. And sometimes you think, oh, I'm just one person. How could I possibly have that happen? But I believe that God would give you a vision, an envision to see your people come to faith in Christ. And you allow you and God to decide what your people are. You need to decide that there is a group of people that I have a heart for, and I'm asking God to give me those people for his name and claim them for his name. And the question would be that you need to answer every day, how many of your people will hear the gospel today? Your end vision should play a part in the bigger vision that God has for this world. And we're told that the gospel is going to go to the whole world. And your part, you play a part in the total vision, the end vision that God has to take the gospel to every nation on the earth. And you can say, well, I can't take the gospel to every nation. That's absolutely true. But you can take the gospel to your people and you play a part in God's bigger picture. We're told in scripture that he's not willing that any should perish, but that all should come to repentance. He's commanded us to go and make disciples of all people groups all over the world, everyone engaged everywhere, telling everyone about the incredible good news of Jesus Christ. Whatever part you play in that, you do play a part, and God's desire is that you will accompany him in accomplishing his vision for the world. That is the end vision.